Jesus, of course, spoke about compassion and humility, but now some are asking, will that message perhaps be muffled when delivered by an actor who looks like he could be a male model? Of course, we're talking about The Son of God, the first movie produced by Roma Downey and husband Mark Burnett. He's the reality genius behind Survivor. The couple aiming to appeal to a younger generation and now raising some eyebrows. ABC's Rena Nainan is here with more on this story. How could this be controversial? Oh, all boy. And let me tell you, the man generating all the buzz is 34, a former telenovela star, telling ABC News he's slightly embarrassed by all the attention he's getting for his good looks. Even Oprah calling him hot Jesus. When Jesus broke bread with his 12 disciples at the Last Supper and said, This is my body. This was not what the good Lord meant. Meet Portuguese actor Diogo Morgado. Don't be afraid. Appearing in the movie Son of God, he plays the title role, Jesus. Speaking with ABC's George Stephanopoulos last week. You know, I grew up as a Christian, and I always think of Jesus as, as someone right next to us. Attractive, ripped, gorgeous. Terms faithful followers don't typically apply to Christ. There is something unusual about him. Twitter divided on the historical accuracy, but both sides crowning him hashtag hot Jesus. But how does he stack up to others who have played the same role? There was Ted Neely in Jesus Christ Superstar. Jim Caviezel in The Passion of the Christ. Many agree with Morgado playing Jesus. Sunday school was never like this. There are going to be people who will say that the use of an attractive actor in a movie like this as Jesus may detract from the film's ultimate story. But that being said, I think given the success of the Bible, there's no way that this movie can really flop. Exactly what movie producers are hoping for. Blessed be the Hollywood box office numbers. One of you here will betray me to my enemies. The film debuts this weekend. Overnight, we did speak with a biblical scholar, my mother. <laughs> she goes to church every Sunday, reads the Bible in multiple languages. And I asked her, how many times in the Bible do, do they refer to Jesus' abs? She told me to stop asking ridiculous questions. <laughs> Mom Marino. <laughs> Don't call Mom. It was Dan Biana's fault. Our religious in-house expert. Thanks, Rita. Good to see you guys.